Hello and welcome to Trans TV News Summary. I am Ibrahim Yusuf. Now the news in brief. The Niger Police Force on Wednesday announced a total restriction of all vehicular movements during the February 25th elections from 12 a.m. to 6 p.m. Force spokesperson Olumuiwa Adejobi in a statement said the restriction order exempted those on essential services such as INEC officials, election observers, ambulances and firefighters responding to medical emergencies. The federal government has instructed state controllers of correctional centers to reject inmates when they do not have the capacity to accommodate them. Speaking in Abuja, Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Interior, Shuaib Balgori, said custodial centers had witnessed a surge in inmates in recent years. He said the efforts are being made to expand the facilities. NDLA operatives have destroyed 7,286 kilograms of warehouse skunk and five hectares of its plantation in Ujogba Forest Reserve in Ishan West, local government area of Edo State. A statement signed by Femi Baba Femi said that the, during the exercise on Wednesday, two rifles, spent cartridges of short guns and an empty shell of AK-47 rifle were recovered, while a 24-year-old suspect, Calvary Essien, was arrested. And at least 96 people have been killed in more than two weeks of clashes between security forces and clan members in the breakaway Somali region of Somaliland. Hospital Director Ahmed Mohammed Hassan on Thursday said they have 96 dead and 560 wounded in the contested towns of Las Anod. The UN says more than 185,000 people have been displaced by the violence. And that wraps up Trust TV News Summary for this hour. For more news, you can subscribe and follow us across all our social media platforms. I am Ibrahim Yusuf. Thanks for watching.